The Helen Sussman Foundation, HSF, a human rights organization that successfully challenged the South African government's plan to revoke Zimbabwean exemption permits ZEPs, by December 2022, says their second application to oppose the appeal request made by South Africa's Minister of Home Affairs has since been the target of nasty and dangerous misinformation campaigns. This statement follows court proceedings on September 18. 2023, where South African Home Affairs Minister Aaron Motsaledi and the Director General, DG, of the Department of Home Affairs, DHA, Livawani Tommy Makode, argued in Pretoria's Gauteng High Court that their government has no grounds for continuing to allow the ZEPs as that was a temporary solution. Motsaledi and Makode are seeking permission to approach the Supreme Court of Appeal to overturn a previous judgment that declared the termination of the ZEP program unlawful and unconstitutional. According to reports, judgment in that case has been reserved. However, HSF said it made a separate application, not yet heard by the court, to oppose the appeal request made by South Africa's Home Affairs Ministry, but lamented how their application has since been the subject of malicious and Dangerous Misinformation Campaigns The campaigns led by shadowy actors on social media have sought to incite violence against HSF staff for allegedly preventing the minister from making migration policy in general. Nothing about HSF litigation in this matter not the original review of the decision to terminate the ZEP nor the application to keep it in force pending a finalized appeal process does anything of the sort, said HSF following the court proceedings. The human rights organization said in each application, HSF has simply sought to protect the basic rights of ZEP holders as people who have lived in South Africa perfectly lawfully for the past 14 years. They have to live by fair and rational government decision-making.